Ashley, well, a teenager is accused of shooting a boy this evening while the boy was walking to his school this morning. NBC Local 33's Sydney Simone is live at the Baton Rouge Police Department with those details. Sydney? Good evening, Jacob. Police say that. 10th grader at Broadmoor High School was shot during an attempted robbery, and today they addressed the community during a press conference at Broadmoor High School. We ask that families get involved. We cannot do it by ourselves. Gun violence amongst minors, a serious topic of conversation across the country lately. This time happening right here in Ben Rouge. A 10th grade student at Broadmoor High School was shot in the abdomen area during an attempted robbery. This happened while the teenager was walking to the bus stop around 6.30 Wednesday morning. He committed this crime this morning. Uh, due to us having information as to who he was, we were able to quickly uh, go and apprehend him. The shooting took place in the 12,000 block of Archery Drive, about two and a half miles away from the school grounds. Authorities say the 15 year old male who shot the victim is no longer a student. He was expelled about a month ago for undisclosed reasons. However, this is the teenager's second attempted robbery in the span of a few weeks, according to the Baton Rouge Police Department. We did a search warrant of his home. We we're able to gather uh, vital evidence that it, that's going to be crucial to our case. When it comes to gun violence amongst kids, Superintendent Dr. Cito Narcisse says the school cannot do this alone. We also work with counselors to have more conversation with kids. Uh, one of the things we put in place is we've decreased the ratio of counselor to students. BRPD wants to emphasize this shooting did not happen on campus, nor is the incident school related. The victim just happened to attend Broadmoor High School. This is not widespread across all of our schools, but there are particular uh, neighborhoods and communities that we have to be much more aggressive about in terms of trying to ensure that we decrease incidents. Sergeant L. Jean McNeely wants to leave parents with an important message. Check their room. See what. Uh, 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 information they're sharing on social media. Go underneath the bed, underneath the mattress. See if they have guns in their, own, uh, in their room. And the victim is expected to make a recovery, and the police want to emphasize that this was not a targeted uh, robbery, and the suspect will be facing two counts of armed robbery, one for this incident and one count for the incident that did happen about a month ago. Reporting live right out here outside of the Baton Rouge Police Department, Sydney Simone, NBC Local 33 News. All right, thank you, Sydney. Now, we do want to say that police have not released the names of the suspect or victim since they are minors.